We don't threaten you, we come in peace! Why are you shooting? This is threatening them. You are threatening them with peace, you know. We come in peace! Oh. Here we are in Belain peacefully protesting against this wall and here they are the Israeli soldiers on the other side shooting at us shooting deadly weapons at us they killed Bassam two three years ago peacefully demonstrating here we are you see the gas shooting at peaceful protesters this is what we get for protesting peacefully this is how Israel responds to peaceful protests what do they want they want instead people to go into cities and blow them up that's the alternative. That's what people are gonna do if they can't protest peacefully. This is this is money. These these gas canisters. You know who pays for that? That's my American government. They pay for that. My tax dollars are going. Are going to those gas canisters that are gonna be shot at me. Well spent American dollars. Three billion every year. <laughs> Oh, shit water. This is shit water. They're, they're, they're shooting shit at us. Israeli settlers building built right there. The Israeli government gives Israeli citizens cheap housing here so they can so they can take over Palestinian land and ultimately make it impossible for Palestinians to have a, a, a free, independent, sovereign state here. That's the point of these settlements right here, to make it impossible for Palestinians to have a state. Listen, what are you guys doing with guns? Go to university! Go get yourself an education! What are you standing there for? You're wasting away your days! Go learn something useful! Contribute to the world! Mayesh, Mayam! No, 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 no. It's not for us. No. Yafi. Oh, see what they're doing here? They shoot the gas and they're burning down all these olive groves. These the olive groves that Palestinians live off of. El Razak is the livelihood. Here, this is what they want. They want to destroy all the Palestinian olive groves so that they just leave, so that they just get out of the country. That's what they want. Dear friends in America, I ask you, when it's your chance to vote in 2012 for Obama or Romney or your local senator or, or, or governor, think about it, think seriously. You want to vote for someone who supports the people that do this, who supports the people that shoot at us, who supports, supports the people that support violence, or on the other hand, do you want to support the people, the people who are resisting violence, the people who are resisting